Africa, the youngest continent in the world, has a population of nearly 1.3 billion people. It is estimated that 145 million live in East Africa, and around half of this number are young people aged between 15 and 24 years. With such a large youth population, there is an urgent need for effective family planning services. However, young people in East Africa find it incredibly challenging to access reproductive health and family planning services due to limited access to youth-friendly services, lack of confidentiality and inadequate information on sexual reproductive health. Young girls and women are particularly disadvantaged. Many are unable to complete their education due to unintended pregnancies, sexual transmitted diseases and in some cases, early marriage. In addition, they can be subjected to gender-based violence and discriminatory practices which increase their vulnerability. Family planning creates an opportunity for these girls and young women to make informed decisions about healthy timing and spacing of their pregnancies. Furthermore, family planning helps young girls pursue their education, participate in public life and secure paid employment opportunities. Family planning is a critical element of socio-economic empowerment and growth. With fewer children, families have more disposable income to save or invest. Furthermore, a smaller portion of children mean that a greater percentage of the population in a country will be able to access jobs. The greater beneficiaries here are the youth. And with that, youth are eager to extend the benefits through peer-to-peer -peer education. This is not only good for them, it is also good for their families, communities and the welfare and prosperity of their countries. In order to address these challenges, DSW empowers youth champions in Kenya, Uganda and Tanzania to advocate for increased funding for reproductive health and family planning. Their voices influence key decision makers in investing in family planning services. DSW believes that youth are powerful agents of change as they are proactive in raising the visibility of family planning and in helping policymakers and leaders recognize the benefits of family planning. For this reason, DSW enables young people to engage with their communities, their peers, health service providers and decision makers within government to champion for change. Young people have a right to participate in civic processes and public forums to communicate their need for reproductive health and family planning services to health care providers. Unfortunately, there are not enough financial resources and human capital available to meet the family planning needs for young people. These areas must be invested to ensure that the youth of today can access health information, services and supplies. Proper investment will lead to a reduction of unintended pregnancies, a reduction in sexual transmitted infections and a brighter future for all. The governments of Kenya, Uganda and Tanzania have all committed to invest in family planning. But committing is not enough. They need to be willing to work with young people and engage them so as to reduce infant and maternal mortality caused by pregnancy-related complications. Working in collaboration with the next generation of leaders is a positive step for Kenya, Uganda and Tanzania. We believe that young people can make a difference. Nothing is stronger than their potential.